for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now please pause for the 30 seconds of silence. Good morning, Grizzlies. I'm Isa. I'm Josiah. And I'm Sophie with GNN, your Grizzly News Network. Today is Monday, April 15th, 2024. We have a lot to be proud of here on GNN. Our broadcast team went to state competition last week and brought home gold medals. Watch the moment where they realize they won. Our broadcast team consisting of Michael, Marion, Zadius, and Emma beat 17 other teams in the broadcast competition, which involved writing scripts and making a three-minute broadcast. The team worked tirelessly to, and were awarded the top prize. Congrats, Grizzlies. Along with our GNN win, our computer science students proved their skills in web design. Daniel and Chris won silver medals in the web design categories at SkillsUSA for their website about anim animal adoptions. Congrats, guys. Now is the time to grab your tickets for our Beyond the Stars prom. You may have missed the cheapest prom tickets, but now is your chance to grab your tickets for $85 before they go up again. You'll want to grab your tickets as early as you can since the prices will be increasing the closer we get to the big day. The $85 tickets only last until this Friday. Prom will be at the Illuminarium next to Area 15, but you'll not have access to the rest of Area 15. There will be a 360 photo booth with Dolby Surround Music with a DJ, along with all the cool exhibits in the Luminarium. Prom is April 27th, so if you plan on bringing a guest from another school, you must get and turn in a guest pass from room 908. No one will be allowed in without the pass or ID. Speaking of prom, it's time to shine a spotlight on our seniors. Grizzlies, you can now nominate any senior who you believe embodies the spirit of our school community for prom court. Anyone in any grade level are welcome to nominate. The top five for each position will be announced on Monday, April 22nd. If you're selected on prom court, you may campaign leading up to prom. Make sure to scan the QR code on screen to nominate people for king and queen. Final voting will take place at the dance. Let's make this prom unforgettable. Hey, Isa, what clubs are going on today? Well, Sophie, there are several clubs meeting today. If you're interested in developing your business skills, consider joining DECA, which will meet in room 201 for their bi-weekly meeting. And if you want to learn more about the medical field, try joining Public Health Club, which meets every other week in room 905. If you want to learn animation, then come to Animation Club, meeting today and Thursday in room 918. And check out Salam Unity, which is happening every other day every other Monday in room 314. The club hopes to offer a place for Ethiopian and Eritrean communities to gather. And finally, Ro Robotics Club meets every Monday and Friday in room 505A. All meetings start at 2.01 p.m. Get out there and support some new clubs you can join. Students, Gaming Club is hosting a Mario Kart tournament on Friday, April 19th in the library at 2 p.m. Do you think you have what it takes to outrace all the others? Bring your skills and prove it. Friday, April 19th in the library, every single person on campus is welcome to play. This past weekend, the Spring, Va Spring Valley Model United Nations team competed at MUN conference at ATEC High School and won an amazing amount of awards. Sebastian won a research award, Christina won an honorable mention award, Bijan and David all won outstanding delegate awards, and Jordan, Jenna, and Julian won the highest award of best delegate. Spring Valley also won the award for the best large delegation. Congratulations to all of the SVMUN delegates. Outstanding job. Spring Valley Theater is hosting auditions for a concert-style show of musical theater songs called Broadway Night. 
The auditions are April 16th and 18th from 2 to 4. All par participants are required to pick a sign-up slot and pick up an audition packet in room 405. The theater before auditions. Bring your best singing voice and sign up today. Auditions are next week. Grizzlies, do you need help with your AP classes? Well, you're in luck. CCSD is hosting virtual boot camps to help students study for their upcoming exams. They are completely free and will be hosted on two upcoming Saturdays. They offer help for classes like AP World History, AP Pre-Calc, AP Computer Science, and more. Scan the top QR code to see details about the dates and classes and scan the bottom one to sign up. Also, time is running out to make sure you are recognized on Senior Awards Night. You need to turn in all your college acceptances and scholarship awards, even if you turn them down. You, we want to recognize you for the honor. Upload one letter or email screenshot at a time. Scan the QR code for the link to the Google form or look for your senior email. And speaking of awards and grad night, here's a look at important news. Mark your calendar, senior sunset date is being changed. So stay tuned and we will update you on that. Prom is scheduled for April 27th from 7 to 10 p.m. Then grad night will be Friday, May 17th, all leading to graduation. Wednesday, May 22nd at 3 p.m. at the Thomas and Mack Center. The final countdown is on, seniors. And as we prepare for all those events, if you'd like to be featured in the senior slideshow, which will be showcased at these events, simply submit your photos using the QR code provided. You can also DM us your photos on our Instagram page at Spring Valley 2024. Don't miss this opportunity to leave your mark on our senior year memories. Hey, Josiah, what's happening in sports this week? There's quite a few things happening this week, guys all. Take a look at the sports going on this week. Today, varsity baseball plays here at home against Coronado at 3.30. On Tuesday, varsity softball plays against Doro at 3.30, and boys volleyball will be playing at Chaparral, and boys volleyball plays away at Chaparral Varsity at 6, JV and B team at 5. On Wednesday, varsity baseball plays at home against Green Valley at 3.30, and JV plays at Green Valley at 4.30. On Thursday, Varsity Softball plays against Basic here at home at 3.30, and JV plays at Basic at 4.30. Track and Field will have a home meet this Thursday against the Charter Schools at 4.30. On Friday, Varsity Baseball faces off against Green Valley again in their home turf at 3.30, and JV faces them here at home at 4.30. And Boys Volleyball will play Amplis Academy here at home varsity at 6, JV and B team at 5. And finally, Saturday Swim and Dive will face off against Faith Lutheran at Pavlin Pool at 8 a.m. Make sure to get out there and support our athletes, Grizzlies. Coach Teal is leading our Lady Softball players this spring, but he's also kicking off fall football next week. All juniors, sophomores, and freshmen interested in playing football for Spring Valley in the fall of 2024 school year need to be at spring football practices. They begin Monday, April 15th from 5 to 7 p.m. You must have a current RMA with a physical and up-to-date insurance. Spring ball will be full contact practices to prepare for our team for next fall. Equipment checkout is set for Saturday, April 13th. Juniors and softballs. Juniors and sophomores at 10 a.m. and freshmen at 11.30 a.m. The Spring Valley Football Program would like to add our talented group of players. So if you think you have game, come out and join us. Go Grizzlies! In national sports news, the NBA regular season is over and the playoffs are here. The play-in tournament starts tomorrow with the Lakers taking on the Pelicans and the Warriors facing the Kings. In the East, Miami takes on Philadelphia and Hawks take on Bulls. On Saturday, the first round of the playoffs starts. Yola take tomorrow weather this week. Well, it's actually going to be pretty hot. Today we have a high of 75 with a low of 56. On Tuesday we have a high of 82 with a low of 61. On Wednesday we have a high of 88 with a low of 63. But on Thursday we have a high of 87 with a low of 65. Grizzlies, do you like Ben and Jerry's ice cream? If so, you can get a chance to scoop up free treats on Tuesday, April 16th. That's because Ben and Jerry's will host its 40th annual free ice cream cone day. Guests can stop by on Tuesday from noon to 8 p.m. Dessert fans can pick up their cones at the district at Green Valley Ranch and help a good cause at the same time. The scoops and the, and the Henderson location is also accepting donations, which will go to the Serving of Our Kids Foundation. The organization helps feed homeless at risk and food insecure children throughout Clark County, County providing meal bags to children who would otherwise not get a meal when not in school. The store will also face painters, will have painters and music. Now back to you at the desk, Sophie. Thank you, Lucivion. If you're in need of food at home, our NJRTC is here to help. SVHS NJRTC's program and the Just One Project are having their monthly food distribution on Saturday, April 20th, starting at 8.30 a.m. 
You can arrive in a vehicle in the school's front parking lot to receive free groceries. This is the last food distribution being hosted by NGRTC this school year. Spring Valley is hoping to put together a large team to take part in the Best Buddies Friendship Walk this year. The walk is on May 4th at 10.45 a.m. at Quarterstone Park in Henderson, which is near Wigwam and Stephanie. Scan the QR code to register and make sure you join the Spring Valley Grizzlies team. All are welcome. You do not need to be a member of the Best Buddies to take part in the walk. If you missed anything important or if a QR code went by too quickly, you can find these daily announcements on YouTube. You can search up Spring Valley High School and look for our Grizzly GNN and Grizzly logo for the correct school. This was Isa, Josiah, Sophie, and Latavia of the, of the Grizzly, Grizzly News Network. Network. Have, Have a marvelous Monday, Grizzlies. Grizzlies.